Hi there, Jamie Keat here today at Teachers Tech. Hope you're having a great day today. Today I want to show you a little trick on how to add an image to text inside Microsoft Word. So if you look at this example a little, bit, a little bit more closely, you can see that there's waves and a surfer inside the text. And that's what I want to show you how to do. So I'm going to start from a brand new document and show you how to quickly do this. So you can do a lot of different things to the font by simply selecting and going up to the font group and from colors to gradients to um, adding all the different effects uh, to it. But one thing you won't find is how to add an image uh, to any of this. And so what you need to do is I'm just going to delete this and you need to insert. Uh, so if we go up to insert and then go to smart art. So I'm going to click on smart art here and I'm going to put something in. Uh, it's going to be the list. It's going to be actually this one right here. So if you go to your list, if it wasn't there, it's this first one. And I'm just going to, uh, you notice that there's five different spots. I only need one of these spots. Uh, so what I'm going to do is actually just uh, click on each of these on the edge and delete until I only have one left. So now I'm going to type in my text right here at this spot like so. So I have the text. Now the next thing I can do with this is I'm going to highlight my text and uh, I'm going to just right click and I'm going to make it a little thicker the uh, text on this. Uh, just something we're going to go with this one right here. This will do the trick. Uh, and then the next thing what you need to do is go to the format right here. So if I go to format, uh, you'll notice that there's text fill here. So if I go ahead, go to text fill, we have a picture right here. So we can have gradient and texture and all that, but if you want to put a picture into this, we can go to picture and now I could upload, or I could go from stock images, online pictures, uh, all this one. So if I go uh, from a file, upload from my computer, and I'm just going to use the one in example with the waves and the surfer in here. And then you can see it in the background. So if I click off of it, you can see, um, I'll just click off that. You can see it. Now you're probably wondering, well, I don't want the blue on this. Uh, what you can do though, if you go back to format up top here, notice that there, this is the shape. So this is the text fill over here and this is the shape fill. Well, I don't want any. So now I have, my teacher's tech with, I'll just click off of it so you can see it in white, you can see it with the image inside of it. You can still do more uh, things to this. If I go ahead, I'm just going to right click on this and go to format shape. Uh, you can see the format shape opens up and I have some options here. So I can go, make sure you have this highlighted for it to work. But if I go over to, uh, you can see this is, I could change it from this point here. I could go insert another picture and it'll bring me back to the same thing. I could go to the different fills and all those. So you can alter it from there, but I can also start to add my different uh, parts here. So if I wanted it to have a shadow, I could go through and I'll just click and click off and you can see a little bit of a shadow uh, around it. So I can go back and I'll just add a couple more ones. I'll go to uh, just a glow. Actually, I'll go to reflection, pick this, and I'll just do this one right here because then you can see it a little bit better. Uh, so you can add all these effects to it and go through and customize it just the way you want. So that's just a little trick on how to insert an image inside text of Microsoft Word. And remember, you can still move this around too. Uh, if you click in it, you can grab, get your move handles and just drag it down. You can change the size of it if you grab the corners and bring it in. And notice that there's two different uh, two different ones uh, on it. So if I click in this, there's the inside handles and outside handles. If I make uh, the inside ones smaller, it's still keeping the frame of the outside here. Uh, and if you go back, and I'm just going to click on this on the edge, you have your uh, layout options depending on how you want it to work with text. So you can go ahead and pick which one uh, if you're inserting this into text to see what would work best for you. So I hope you like this uh, little tip on how to insert an image inside your text in Microsoft Word. Let me know if it comes in handy for you. Thanks for watching this week on Teachers Tech. I'll see you next time with more tech tips and tutorials.